Every Friday, we show you the positive stories in eastern Idaho of the people and places that we all appreciate. We call it The Bright Side, and tonight we start with a man who's protected and served eastern Idaho for three decades. After 32 years of law enforcement service, Captain Darren Cook says goodbye to the Idaho Falls Police Department. Cook started his police career at the Shelley Police Department in 1985 and then moved to Idaho Falls in 1987. Cook says it's been fun getting to make a difference, adding he's been very fortunate to work with a lot of great people. And gratitude and appreciation are blossoming at Pocatello Valley Montessori School. Yesterday, their elementary students hosted a thanks a bunch gratitude banquet to honor local heroes in the community. They provided brunch and performed several songs for Idaho State Police officers and firefighters with the Idaho Falls Bureau of Land Management. And in preparation for the event, the BLM visited earlier in the week to teach the kids about wildfire suppression. Chief Meteorologist Doug Iverson hit the road again with another edition of Junior Brainstormers. This week, his travels took him to Hillview Elementary in Ammon, where he had the opportunity to visit with fifth graders. With the nice weather lately, the excitement is in the air about next week. Students and teachers are definitely looking forward to spring break. Probably hanging out with friends, playing a little football in the yard. Oh, yeah. I'm totally <laughs> pumped for this. This to-do list is about... It keeps going like this every day, so... I'm gonna go skeet shooting. Really? Skeet shooting. Awesome. I have to do that. Just have to. Cool. It's a must. And finally, a big donation to a local hospital will help cancer patients with their medical bills. Spinderella presented the Portniff Cancer Center with a check for $23,000. The money goes towards the Cancer Patient Assistance Fund, which provides financial assistance to patients who experience income problems as a result of a cancer diagnosis. That includes gas and transportation, housing bills, groceries, and medications. And if you have an idea for the bright side, please send us an email for information interested in the positive stories about the people and places of eastern Idaho, you can send them to newsroom at kpvi.com and we'll see you on the bright side.